Oop, I should move over here. Yeah. Hello. Hey there. It's Friday, and it's kind of gray out here in Pittsburgh. Yeah, I can see our faces. Has, has Halloween slowly creeps up on us and and Christmas and Christmas. <laughs> I mean, Mike T is just <laughs> doing what's you know what the stores are doing already. That's right. Christmas is coming early for me. Depends, <laughs> depends on how often you visit Target, I guess. Uh, for those of you first joining us, I'm Dave Bennett. I'm the lead designer and project director of Orion Trail. And I'm Patrick Gilbert, uh lead designer and project director for the Null Point. And I'm Mike T. I am not relevant to this project, except that I'm here hanging out with you guys. And he's here giving us Christmas spirit. And I yeah. brought the Christmas spirit with me, as I always do. So, uh, due to various time constraints and the fact that the Orion Trail build is a little more unstable than usual, we are not going to play Orion Trail today. I know, it's real sad. But we actually get to spend the whole time checking out the sweet new changes that uh, these guys have been making to the Null Point prototype. And I will be the guinea pig playing it live on the internet for everyone. And these two guys will be talking about what's different and... Uh, watch me flail around. Yes. Yeah, and we'll also be trying to take uh, questions from the chat again uh, if you're wondering what's changed. This is our first really big prototype update, and this did just go live now. So if you'd like to oh, cool. uh, play it, you can just go to nullpoint.shellgames.com and download it. All right. And play exactly what we've got here. I'm going to click this button. Also, be sure to let us know if audio levels are weird, if yeah. we're too quiet, too loud, uh, too yeah. spooky, whatever. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. We're in the null point now. Uh, I'm gonna make a new cycle because last time I made a cycle with boobies and that was just not appropriate. Great. So. What? I wasn't here last week. <laughs> that was a whole different story. <laughs> oh yeah, no, I set the. I set the. Uh, you can enter uh, keys as names now too. Oh nice. Uh, I, so. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Uh, again, yeah, it's this is pressure right now. Great. It's a new build 2015, the so, perfect seed. So what's going on with the seed? What exactly does that do? Uh, so for, for anybody that's familiar with Minecraft uh, or uh, Binding of Isaac, we now also support seed generation. So you're naming your game, which is a whole new build, but it's a new build 2015 is actually the random seed key that is being used to generate this unique world. And anybody that can actually figure out what the heck you typed in there will be able to uh, generate this exact world and play through it. Cool. I'm gonna that is pretty cool. I'm going to begin the cycle. I'm, I'm not a Minecrafter. No. So I need to know these things. You got to keep up with the lingo? Yeah. I mean, you, you seem so ahead of the times with your Christmas stuff. Yeah. This is... All the kids are wearing <laughs> Santa Claus that's, sweatshirts now. That's compensation. Right. Yeah. All right. So here I are. Hello, friend. Welcome to the stream. Hey there, Helvetica. Hey, Nightbot said hi. Wow. That's awesome. <laughs> That's <laughs> kind of unnerving, actually. We live, we live in the future. All right. So in honor of Nightbot. So I have a new survivor. Uh, am I crazy, or did the visual effects get changed a little bit, too? I might uh, be going crazy. Some, you might be going crazy. The visual effects are going to be a little bit different. I'll uh, change it, Vino. Thank you. I, I don't know how many people are, are really going to notice, but we've moved over to screen space uh, GUIs over top of the character's head, so we'll have a lot less... Sure. Jittering and jumping, everything should look a lot more crisp. And there's been a lot of updates to your portrait and all of the portrait controls. Sure. So we now are supporting hotkeys, control groups, all that jazz. We've got a control map if you go to the pause menu and go to options. You can actually see oh, all neat. of our controls laid out. Cool. Okay. Uh, our. I know last time there was a bug with... Uh, keys overlapping with each other, and uh, whenever I tried to rotate the camera, my guy would sit down. <laughs> yep, that's been fixed now. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> so the three, your three main hotkey buttons at the bottom are hold fire, deploy, and then walk and run, which is a new dimension okay, sure. of the game right now. Now we're walking. It doesn't look quite as stiff. Oh, this, wait, Nightbot has hair now. Oh yeah, all, all of our... Uh, and like clothes. All of our survivors are now randomly generating with different equipment, different textures, and uh, hair, beards, and eyewear. Sure. If they have them. So in general, your survivors should look a lot different from each other now, and should look a lot more like their portraits. Right. Okay. Cool. Beep boop. Select camp. Anyone is there? Gets left behind. All right. I don't want to be left behind. So let's see. 
That's uh, some sort of compound. Dia diazane. Di it's a green med kit. Used to treat extreme anxiety and panic attacks. Often prescribed to combat the effects of deep space travel and the psyche, despite the risk of addiction. All right. So, am I going to become addicted? Am I a drug addict now? You. No, you yeah, I, t I touched the drug, so you're still sane. All right. So that's good. I mean, if Dare taught me, any, taught me anything, it's that touching, even looking at drugs, will get you addicted. <laughs> even discussing them. Yeah. So we do actually have a lot more story in this build than we did in the previous prototype. Sure. The, the, there was a note down there next to the diazane. Oh. Oh. I thought it was the, the diazane. Okay, let's take a look. Uh, attention UNC expedition members, we are attempting to regain radio contact with the dive ships outside the null point. Please remain in your base camps in the meantime. Above all else, remain calm. Use of issued diazane injections is authorized if necessary. All right, good. So things are going so well that they're letting us use our drugs. Oh, here we go. It's That's important. Drugs. Diazane, more like triazane. Good one. Exa I'm exactly. It, it actually was harder than it should have been to find a, a good name for our diazane compound. Sure. Did you got, is, is that a real generic drug name that you're allowed to use? It is a, it's a fake generic drug name based off of a real generic drug name. Got it. Uh, we we'd actually looked up the real thing and discovered that it's actually a horrible drug and very addictive. And you did, weren't comfortable putting it in the game. It, it was edgy enough that the first Metal Gear Solid had it in the game yep. and then took it out. So we figured that we didn't want to walk back on that. Interesting. I remember it being in there, mm -hmm. and I know what it was, and I won't say it now because apparently it's... Yeah. We can't well, even we'll, talk about it. In honor of hard drugs, we will... <laughs> Great. All right, so we've got Nightbot and hard drugs. <laughs> yeah, we're having a party. Yeah. <laughs> now, this is, now this is no point. <laughs> you're, you're ready for a rave. All right, let's see. So how can I tell the difference between a tutorial node and a story node, if there's any difference? Uh, currently you can't. They both have the same effect, okay. but you can see once you've opened it that our, our, our tutorial notes and our notes that are like exposition, like things that you're noticing in the world or that your characters are noticing, show up in those black windows in the bottom of the screen. Right. And anything that's actually like written on a PDA gotcha, shows sure. up in the PDA. Nemo, yeah, Nightbot knows how to throw a party, all right? That's for sure. I mean, he's down to party any time. You just call him over and he just shows up. Yep. It's like a machine. <laughs> just comes strutting in like, Hi, I'm Nightbot. I'm a chat moderator, blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Don't forget to check out the Kickstarter. <laughs> all right, let's zoom in on hard drugs and see his body. Oh, man, look at that. Hammer. Slash pipe. Is it a pipe or a hammer? It's still Could a pipe. Could be both. Oh, pipe. Yeah, no, okay, get a pipe with a junction. Lightweight, strong construction materials were in high demand once the expedition started going deeper into the null point. And pipes. And that's where pipes come from. <laughs> and that's where pipes <laughs> come from. First aid kit. The need for field medicine was, fortunately, never understated in the expedition teams. Accidents were bound to happen, especially in the crumbling outer ruins of Shell Zero. Okay, so are we in Shell Zero, or...? Ah, if you remember your loading screen, we're in Shell 1. Oh, okay, my bad. I, just, I, I, I like how you've got... Hints of story and world cooked into that text, though. That's fun. <laughs> so, what, what other, other drugs, drugs can we make our people take? Well, uh, we haven't found them yet. We that's actually yeah. a stretch goal. <laughs> <laughs> Hard drugs. It's, it's part of the mystery. <laughs> Let's see. Long term space flight made the necessity for plastic rounds obvious after several ships reported catastrophic hull breaches as the result of enforcement action. All right, sure. Don't, don't shoot your metal bullet through the bulkhead. Otherwise, you can go into space. Because the ship keeps you out of space, <laughs> just like <laughs> that's, its, that's its whole job. Yeah, that's like that's its <laughs> raison d'etre. We're gonna get a little, little French in there. That's it, Helvetica. Psychoactive drugs and Robitussin. That's yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, that's we're gonna, what's gonna, in null point. <laughs> the goal of the game is to robo trip to the center of the null point. All right, let's see. Uh, hard drugs. There's another. Oh, there's more diazane. So okay, good. Nightbot's got that. Uh, more ammo. We'll pick that up. There's a story bit. That is a story bit. UNC Emergency Dispatch. Attention research staff. All radio communication is currently being scrambled by an unknown source in Shell 2. Forward expedition teams are breaching the shell now to find the cause of the disturbance. In the meantime, remain calm and report to your station's base camp. Shuttles from the Galahad. 
Did I say that right? Yeah. We'll be with we'll be by within the next forty eight hours to exfiltrate. All right. So something's happening. So we can't talk to each other. That's bad. Wait, you can't speak to each other? I mean, we can talk not over the radio. Oh right. You gotta turn up the radio. I can't sing anymore because then Twitch will mute us. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> We've been muted once already. Oh, I'm losing my mind from something. That sounds like... Shoot with gun, Nightbot. You're you... telling them to hold fire. Oh, farts. <laughs> uh, I thought I had the other guy selected. All right. We're doing okay. Nice. Were you able to kill him before he screamed? I think so. I didn't hear a scream, did you? I didn't. All right. I'm gonna loot the corpse. So, uh, Patrick, can you tell us about the, the new Insanity Halo around the screen? That is something that, uh, I don't know if it was there last week, but I haven't seen it before. Uh, an early version of it was that, that people were, were correctly calling out had a, a lot of issues with it. Since then, we've actually spent a lot of time trying to make this feature more refined and, and get it ready for today. Mm -hmm. uh, it's probably the biggest feature that we've added. Uh, so you, that green strike underneath your health bar on the portrait is your character's current sanity. Uh, and there's a bunch of ways in the game to lose sanity right now. Uh, being near any kind of a monster will make you lose sanity. The closer you are to them, the worse it is. So the more time you spend around monsters, the worse it is. Uh, watching somebody die makes you lose sanity and certain enemy attacks, like the scream from the siren, cause you to lose a lot of sanity if they can get it off. Does the scream need to hit you if, to lose the sanity, or is it just the fact that they screamed is upsetting? The, fact, the, uh, the closer you are to the scream, the more upsetting it is. Gotcha. And I'm flush with resources and pipes. This was a good scene. <laughs> yeah. I think hard drugs might be stuck on something, though. Hard drugs has a lot of problems, all right? Oh, hard drugs is fine. Nightbot might be stuck on something. Nightbot also has problems. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, I found one of our wonderful... Passing, passing corners. There we go. Four med kits, two diazazanes. Now, we're, now we, all we need is some vodka and we get ourselves a party. Perfect. <laughs> yes. Alright, let's see. Uh, meanwhile, in here, H is... How do I hold fire? C, X, Z. Yeah, it's, a, it's the line of keys right under your WASD. Yeah, I, I just have to say, look at the reflection on that floor. Yeah, I know, right? That is a highly polished surface, and I like it. Vodka and Skittles. Yeah. Skittle brow. Interestingly, that is the names of two of my three children. Ooh. Vodka and Skittles? Vodka and Skittles, yeah. Who's the no. third, who's, is the third kid Moonbase or something? It's junior, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Vodka, Skittles, and Junior. Okay. All right, so we got some plastic shells. We got a rifle clip that we can't use yet. Maybe we can combine it with the pipe. More pipes, more plastic shells. So at this point, you should be getting a little bit worried. Because I can tell you, uh, we, we haven't changed so much. There's still a fixed number of enemies in this level. Sure. And if you haven't really been finding them yet, they're all somewhere. Sure. It'll, everything will work out. <laughs> Space vodka and skills is a contraband item. It's very true. ETB says, "Whoa!" Oh. No, oh God! Poop. Yep, you're holding fire again. So it used to be the case that if I was not holding fire during, uh, oh dear, the mode where you know deployed, they would not hold fire. Has that changed? That actually has changed. Okay. We we got a lot of feedback. Uh, Actually, just internally to the office, when people were trying to play, that they were getting really thrown off by trying to keep track of separate states for hold fire and okay. open fire. So we've just unified it, and we're really curious to know when, when people are playing now with the one state world, is that more or less obnoxious? Sure. Well, now I'm thrown off, therefore, I don't like No, it's fine. I just gotta get used to it again. I think I would like it better. But if it was uh, split? No, the unified. Sounds, oh, the unified. It sounds, it sounds less to less to manage mentally for me. It's always good because I'm like... done. Did I just piss off a monster? I have no idea. I don't no, think you did. I think we saw a monster over there, but they didn't quite see you. Yeah, that that sound they make is the the sound cue for them hearing a noise. So I'm hungry. He heard you. Okay, but he didn't see you. He didn't. He didn't engage. 
This is a big room. I hear little bl stor little bloopy bloops. That was something. Uh oh, Nightbot, engage. It's no line of sight. Oh Gotta get around the box. Nightbot, use gun. Use gun to solve problem. <laughs> Do it. Pipe! Oh, and then there's his friend from Vancouver. Two friends. Two friends from Vancouver, out of town. We'll run. We we're losing our minds. Nightbot is losing his her sanity. So I don't want to spoil anything, but what, what does happen when you run out of sanity? I imagine something catastrophically bad. It's it's actually worse than dying. Wow. For everybody involved. Okay. Well, I better use those drugs then. I mean, I, yeah, I, I guess at, at this point we can we can sort of spoil it. Right now, uh, if you uh, completely lose your cool, uh, then you actually turn into a shambler. Oh. Well, you should have spoiled that. Oh, well. That's really good. You're a bad influence. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, everyone. No! Oh! Pipe! Pipe! Hi. Hi. There you go. <laughs> Great. Hard drugs looks like it's gonna need to use some more hard drugs yeah. in a minute. Hard drugs is hitting the pipe. It's <laughs> uh, really stupid. I think we're all fired. All right, look. Perfect. <laughs> that's what. That, that, we're not going to demo day. We're actually going to Chris's office right after this. <laughs> yeah. I just got an email from HR. <laughs> All right, so this is a big room that doesn't look like there's a lot in it. Um, there's a big room, there's a couple directions to go, uh, and there's actually some extra stuff to find in this build. Okay, uh, sure. Compared to the last build that you played. There's a new weapon. Okay, sure. Look at that. Nightbot is a cold-blooded killer. And <laughs> when Nightbot teams up with hard drugs, anything can happen. <laughs> Let's see. Um, oh, if I hit the, I lost my wasd. There it is. All right, my wasd. W was wasn't. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm actually not gonna waste some bullets and try to shoot that guy because he doesn't seem to care. I'm gonna actually hit the C key, so they don't see me coming. There you go. That was, you know, forced. Four, four out of ten. <laughs> So there's a door. I'll go there eventually. I'm trying to see if there's any sort of valuables located within this section of the null point. Oh, oh there's a door over there. And how did I not notice that? <laughs> are we gonna are we gonna do flavored di diazane? <laughs> that's that's deeper in, that's higher levels. I'm, I would say that's definitely a stretch goal. Uh, we have requests for both meteor sounding pipe sounds as well as some sort of meat pipe, like a ham. Well, one of those is a really good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? Yeah. You decide, That's chat. Up to you guys. All right, so Hard Drugs is going to grab another pipe because his pipe is almost broken. Double pipe. Dual wielding pipes. Um, I don't know how much diazane. Or, whoop. How much sanity diazine uh, restores, but it's actually a lot more effective uh, per use than a health kit is. Okay. Yeah, it seemed like it actually. Uh, yeah, no, Nightbot out. went to full basically, and then. But yeah, I don't know. Diazine is actually uh, one of the rarest uh, item drops you can get right now outside of a weapon. Oh, we got another survivor! I'm a survivor oh, next a to shambler. a shambler. Watch out for that shambler. Uh, all right. Uh oh, four shamblers. Ah! Hard drugs. Oh, point gun at that lady. Use gun, solve. Okay, oh, good. And then this guy is gonna pipe it. Oh, jeez. That's a good piping thing. Oh god. Oh no, this is not good piping. Hard drug. What is oh, happening? No. <laughs> Oh, this is probably gonna be the end of the team because I accidentally opened OrionTrail.exe in Windows Media Player. Well, if you, if you oh, lose your sanity, that, it starts yep, launching yep, other games. Yeah, basically. 
Well, great. That spun out of control quickly. That, that's no point. Great. Um, so, if you wanted to try this exact build again, this exact uh, world setup, you can restart the cycle. Sure. And if you want a different uh, map layout, then I have you to can do it on the Yeah. Okay, sure. I love it. It does lose. Yeah, that's basically what happens. But you don't launch it normally. You launch it into Windows Media Player. Right, you, you, drag, you drag your EXE into Media Player, and something might happen. Yeah. You'd be surprised. We we had a lot of requests to go uh, eternal darkness with it and just start doing weird things when sanity is getting low. I thought the train was coming from the game for a second, and so this like howling, terrible noise from behind me. <laughs> yeah, for the, for those who don't know, we we're located down by the train tracks. Griblet asks, "Can you do a sneak play?" Sure, I'll try to do a sneak play. I was trying to do a sneak play, and then I saw a bunch of guys that I wanted to shoot, and then I got distracted. And then I opened the Ryan Trail. But this time, we're going to sneak through. You're trying to sneak into a different game. Yeah. Wow. Dave is perhaps best known up here for flooding text areas. <laughs> These are some very meta names, Dave. <laughs> oh, look, I'm still not over what just happened. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I think this is the end of the tutorial room, so now I'm going to try to sneak. I'm going to use the forbidden knowledge of my previous run through to yep. do better this time. Uh, now I'm also going to do hit Z to hold my fire. And then C will make me sneak good. Die Zane. Got some bullets. <laughs> My memory area wants to know if uh, Windows Media Player on EXE has more health <laughs> than around. I didn't even it, notice that. It seems like you've, you've stretched the health meter. <laughs> I'm guessing it's just scaled up. Hi, hi memory area, congratulations on, on confirming all of our worst paranoid fears about extending that health bar. <laughs> yes. Uh. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to go out on a limb and say no, it does not actually mean that they have more health. That, that's actually something that we're going to be looking at. We'll probably have to either shrink your text or just cap the name over their heads in some shorter amount. Yeah. Yeah, you don't, don't let me do this. This is... I'm being a jerk. All right. I'm bored of walking. Now I'm running. I'm going to grab some sweet... Oh, they heard me. Probably. Or at least I saw something. Why am I losing my mind? So, something that's uh, a useful tip for a sneak playthrough is that your sanity loss is actually based off of uh, vision of the monsters. Okay. If your survivors can't see the monster, then they won't lose the sanity. Oh! Nope, just standing there. I would love to sneak past you, but... Griblet says, survivors should fight each other to the death of the last health pack when they're both bleeding out. It's true. Uh, we agree. <laughs> Alright, in the interest of time, I'm going to shoot the suckers. <laughs> Say, oh, right, I'm holding fire, and now I'm doing this. Blah! Blah! Yeah, I think uh, Hel Helvetica is requesting a poke, poke your eyes out uh, hotkey, I think. Yeah. Ah, oh, the event horizon. Or at least a peekaboo key. Yeah, that would be. <laughs> yeah, neither, neither of those things would really hurt your sanity in this right. situation. So is this guy chasing me? No, he's just he's shambling along. I can't tell if he's, he's listening. He's listening for something. Now so is that it? You're actually kiting him by making noise? Oh, good. I forgot yeah. to turn off yeah. the... Good, great. And that's why we turn off our auto fire. Yes, Nemo, where we're going, we don't need eyes. You really don't. That's also a sweet Event Horizon reference. No, I don't. I haven't seen it. <laughs> you haven't seen it? 
Because you know, I don't have eyes. It's the best sequel. You know, you know it does have eyes though. The hills. Event Horizon is the best sequel to Jurassic Park you'll ever watch. It's true. Interesting. <laughs> Better than Jurassic Park 2? Oh, infinitely. God, that's easy to believe. <laughs> Alright, so we're back in this room. I remember there being a bunch of dudes the other way. Apparently... Oh, I'm all, I'm all full up. Yeah, and we... We didn't tweak the, the drop rate in the dungeon that much, but we definitely felt like, especially in the beginning, we were being a little bit too stingy with the drops. Sure. Uh, it should be more of this, more of I can only take six things with me, which six things do I pick, and less... Oh! Damn! They saw, I, they saw the monster before I saw the monster. And then you're going to aim that way, because I know you're here. Very good. It's a good monster kill. Thanks. It's not very sneaky, but I'm doing my best. Uh, all right. So we're back in this part of the room. Oh, jeez. All right. Jared, it's okay. You can come up and, and join us on the couch while you're waiting for your turn. Oh, the couch. Just like that. Oh, yeah. Jared Mason's actually. We got. Actually... We have Jared Mason on the couch here, yeah, ladies and gentlemen. Not. And they see me. I think. Hurt me. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, run! Damn it! Oh. Pipe! Pipe! Oh, okay, oh. sure. It's the fucking Shambler Quartet over here. <laughs> we are the Shamblers. <laughs> I would like to run now. I think they might also be chasing after you. I don't doubt it. Did they, did they lose interest? I don't oh, see Oh yeah, it. they did. Great! Just oh. like I planned. Shambler that was stuck in the couch over here. That's Jared. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, <laughs> oh, my sanity. <laughs> <laughs> Give me some diazane. Strawberry diazane, please. Oh, ooh, nice. Good choice. Is it diazane? Or yeah, that's that's our real fake drug. Diazane keeps you diazane. And that's that's our real fake slogan for it. Great. I'm gonna use at least one of them for Rock Trail to EXE. Because she has the gun. And then there's this guy over here. Oh, and Nemo's joined Team Shambler. This is like Team Jacob. <laughs> Alright. You know they're not going to win. Here we go, pipe! For oh notes. my god. Open fire. Uh. Oh, that's bad. Well, the good news is that everyone hurt me. <laughs> <laughs> You've got Windows Media Player on hold fire right now. So, uh, ETB's got a, actually a good question there. Uh, if you've got plans to uh, have some more verse for sneaky players so you can uh, draw, draw characters around and stuff, sort of tapping on the floor kind of stuff. Absolutely. Uh, at, at the minimum, we know that we're going to be adding a couple of weapons that are more for avoiding combat than actually making things dead. Uh, the flare gun is going to be a big part of that, because you'll actually be able to fire off something that'll attract the attention of enemies to a particular spot and cool. go by. And if we can get in thrown items, then absolutely we'll have a lot of things like pebbles that you can just toss as a distraction. Nice. You got Goss rifle! That's a thing. That's Hashtag a Team Shambler is going to fucking pick up a Goss rifle. That's, that's, a, well, that's a special to, weapon. Right. Welcome to the Goss rifle. All right, all right so you got one bullet. Let's let's read about the, the Goss. A single UNC Marine armed with the Goss ordinance armed with Goss ordinance can inca incapacitate even a moderately sized dive ship, a fact that the UNC made good use of in order to reach null point ahead of uh, looting crews from the belt. All right, so this is some sort of anti spaceship weapon. Yeah, you can actually take a look at it. It's it's very large. Yes, it is. And what's the what's the uh, 
Oh, okay. Yeah, look at... Oh, my God. <laughs> and there you go. So, so the Gauss rifle works a little bit like a sniper rifle. Sure. You can see that it's got a very long setup time, but a very long range. Sure. And you can actually, uh, in, in big rooms like the one you just came from, set up whoever has the Gauss rifle to be cover sure. for people that spot for him running ahead. All right, well, let's I hope we get a chance to use this on something. Yeah, that sounds really cool. I don't yeah. know I want you to shoot something with it. I know. Oh, wait, what we got? We got more ammo for a pistol shell. Let's give this to <laughs> Windows Media Player, because he does not need three pipes. It's I, his I, preference, okay? My memory area is guessing probably correctly that it is in no way impractical and is the best weapon for every situation. <laughs> sure, you can make that assumption. <laughs> hey man, it's the biggest gun, so it's probably the best. It, it depends. So, it's wildly inaccurate if you're firing it without being deployed. Sure. But it, it's also true that we don't use uh, dice rolls for hits and misses and null point. It's all bullet sim. Oh, so if you that's interesting. if you run up to something's face, you will probably be able to hit it. And if right. you run up so close that the barrel of the gun is beyond it, then you will actually miss it. Wow, I am flush with drugs and guns. Yeah, just like Texas. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can feel the unsubscribes now. <laughs> Maybe a little bit. Sorry, Texas. I'm, I'm You're the best. Good. You're the best. That's a recruit. <laughs> We got the big thumbs up for the man on the couch. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. So we came in from here. Yeah, Windows Media Media Player is not looking too great. Now that I have all this drug, I'm going to apply it to Windows Media Player. Yeah. Good catch, ETB. All right. Uh, let's see. So Team Shambler, are they? They're all holding fire. You're yep. all gonna sneak by now. High memory area asks if you run out of Gauss ordnance, can you use the Gauss rifle as a melee weapon? <laughs> that's, a, that's a good question. It's, it's big enough. It's a good question. It's big enough, but it's deceptively fragile. So, so no, you can't. Just like me. Oh. <laughs> all right. Hey yo. Hey yo. Approved. <laughs> There's also. Um, so you, you did find our rare drop. There's only one Gauss rifle. Okay, cool. In, in the old experience, and that's all the ammo that exists. For all right. So, you in have, the interest of displaying this new weapon, I, yep. could, I should probably save it for a bigger target, but this is just But using perfect. one shot, and I recommend, try to, try to get it so you can see both the, uh, the shooter and the shooty. There you go. Right here. Right here. Oh, that's what saw. Boom! Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That, the, the smoke cloud that came out of uh, hashtag Team Shambler. That was, that was pretty impressive. And, and, and thank you, uh, K, KX8. I'm not sure how to pronounce that, but thank you. X8. Yeah, thanks very much. This, is, this exact build, again, is online right now for free. If you want to just go to nullpoint.shellgames.com and download it, and you can play exactly what Dave's playing right now. There you go. Oh, and then there's, there's the Shambler that heard my very loud and totally practical Gauss and, rifle. And after you check out the game and love it... Uh, Back to Kickstarter. Yeah, make sure you check out the Kickstarter, um, which I can drop a link to. Yeah, do it. Awesome. You can drop a link to both. You know, uh, magical phone. Magic phone. That's you will do. guard the door. The Gauss rifle, by the way, is the loudest thing in the game right now. I don't doubt it. You'll, you'll draw down a lot of, uh, a lot of fire. Oh my glory! All right, so we have this big comical gun to use us in the use on this big comical enemy. Oh, thanks, Snapconda and Curious Mint. I don't even have to use my phone, my magical phone. Woo! <laughs> did it? Did it kill it? <laughs> no. I think it's... you've stunned it. Ah! Here oh it comes. What? Oh, oh my god! It. Use guns! Oh, Team Shambler! Oh, I killed oh, it! Oh, I've never seen that. That's amazing. That is super cool! That is amazing. <laughs> You've taken down the Sentinel. Alright, and now I'm gonna use my med kits, because everyone's dying. <laughs> that was awesome, though. I wasn't even sure if you could kill the Sentinel. A lot of people weren't. We, part of why we wanted to just add in oh! the Gauss rifle now. God damn it! <laughs> Don't fire! 
You are out of bullets. But this isn't. <laughs> yes. There you go. This is the sneakiest playthrough we've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm glad you really... That's good sneaking. Uh, except for all the noise and murder. <laughs> right. <laughs> Look, we don't, we, need, we don't need to get into the specifics of it. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, I'm sorry. All right, so that felt great. I didn't uh, think I was going to do it for a second. Snapconda is uh, scaring me a little bit. <laughs> yeah, come on. Calm, calm down a little bit. It's just a game, Snapconda. Oh, Snap, Snapconda wanted you to investigate the uh, Sentinel Corpse. I think I did, though. It was just a pile of white blood. That's no, a good point. You either. actually knocked it back into the wall when you killed it. Oh, there hello. it is. <laughs> and, and there it is. Nemo does raise a good point. Yeah. If there's no one here, if everyone's dead, then there's no one here to hear us. Therefore, it's, sneakiest. That's about as sneaky as you can do. If you shoot a tree dead in the woods, does it hear you sneak? That is how I've played every single Metal Gear Solid game. It's true. So, so uh, ETB is suggesting that the uh, Gauss rifle not be able to fire when it's not deployed. What, what, what are your thoughts on that, Patrick? Uh, it's it's something we definitely talked about. I, I think if we if we keep playing and we find that a lot of people are just using the Gauss rifle like a shotgun, mm -hmm. and it's a problem and it's not fun. Uh, then we might look into that so that we'll force you to deploy. Oh, we have a, we have a private message. Yeah, I got, pri I got a private message here. I'm trying to read it. No, oh, I mean, don't sorry. read it. Please Jesus. do not read it, Twitch. I'm in the middle of reading it. <laughs> sorry. Delia, if you're reading this, be careful on your way back to the shuttle dock. Something walked out of the wall when Shell 2 opened. It cut Maya in half and started wrecking the base camp. It's still around here somewhere, but you don't have a choice if you want to get to the shuttle before it leaves. It's on some kind of automated routine. Stay out of its light and don't make any noise, and it should ignore you. I'll meet you there, I promise. Well, took care of that problem. Yeah, sounds like you already blew it away. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, yeah, Ryzo, we're actually playing uh, Null Point today. Uh, there will be, we'll be doing some more Ryan Trail next week, and there's going to be a pretty substantial update to it. Uh, but uh, we're, yeah, we're doing the Null Point today. Yep. And so yeah, this is, this is not uh, just the most awesome away mission you've ever seen for Ryan Trail. It's actually a completely different game. So. Yeah, if it was a Ryan trail, we'd have about 40 more characters and they'd all be dying. <laughs> <laughs> all right, yeah, as, as dark as this game is, we kill off fewer red shirts than a Ryan It's true, no. It, uh, casualties by volume, we've got you beat. Yeah. No, Ryan trail point. Yeah, that's the inevitable uh, sequel to both games. Right. <laughs> use your bravado against the sentinel. I think you did. I th yeah, I'm pretty oh, yeah, sure. I think that's actually what happened. I don't, I don't know, guys. Using the Gauss cannon was pretty sword. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it really is. Well, the uh, the good decision that you made there was not panicking and undeploying it. Yeah, well, you know, I'm shocked. I, I'm, honestly, I'm surprised I didn't do that. But, you know, that's we're all learning. Uh, I kind of want to heal Windows Media Player, but he is very low health. But we also kind of need that in case someone starts bleeding out. Uh, Griblet wants to know if the seed, if you play the same same seed over again, are the drops in the same place? Yes, uh, the drops will be in the same place. I oh, think the only thing that gets re-randomized is the amount. So where you where you previously found fifteen bullets, you might find nine or ten. Hey, how you doing? No, a chambler's no, like no. Oh. Um. I am uh, room three, Shambler. Hello, Come I'm on. Shambler number three. Welcome to my room. Yeah, right this way. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Windows Media Player. Follow me. Use gun. There you go. Apply directly to the Shambler. <laughs> All right, we're doing this. And I realize I'm hogging up Jared's playtime. I'm really sorry about this. That's all right. We can, we can run a little bit later. Yeah, we can go long. It's fine. I, I say volunteering Jared's. <laughs> Jared's got nothing to do. Uh, all right. So now I'm sneaking by. We have Team Shambler on hold fire. This is a very well lit room and a nice space shuttle. Yeah, I am very nice. excited about this. this all right. Nice. Uh, there's another military grade rifle. I'm going to drop one of the pipes because I don't think that's as cool as a gun. Because it looks like I'm about to go on a field trip in the Magic School Bus. That is a spaceship. Uh, there seems to be some sort of document here. To stir. Oh, well. That was riveting. <laughs> <laughs> just, I just need oh, a minute. Well, great. <laughs> oh. It's my emotions that have been stirred. <laughs> Whoa! 
All right, look at that. We got another med kit. Everything's great. Windows Media Player, you get the med kit. Uh, I think that's it. Yeah, look at that ramp. Go up that ramp. I'm going. Jesus. You're, you're killing post Argus. Oh, look. All right. I got to make sure that I got some delicious yep. med kits. Actually, what if what is stir? I missed it too. Nemo wants to know. Oh, that that is a bug. Stir. I think I think stir is a name of someone, but nothing happened. No, now, you, you got our you got our just before final release build that uh, has a bug now. So if I wanted to, so let me t let me try to talk through this. Yeah. So I was guarding my dudes with the, the guy on the ramp, and he was aiming there. But I remembered that from a previous playthrough that everyone in the blue circle is the ones that make it into the ship. Mm -hmm. If my guy guarding on the ramp isn't in the blue circle when I click the button, does he not get to go out? That's correct. Okay. So in the but in the non-demo flow where that actually matters, um, one the blue circles are bigger, and two it asks you if you want to leave. Gotcha. Before you actually do. So okay, you'll, good. You'll get a pop-up on screen. I was gonna be very upset if Windows Media Player didn't make it back with me. No, we we don't want you to accidentally abandon your covering fire. Yeah. All right, great. I did it. That was awesome. Congratulations. That Thanks for playing through. You yeah. Killed I killed a sentinel with a really big gun. <laughs> I'm glad that's, that's the takeaway story. And, and it was a big, and it was bigger. But I was like, no, I got a big gun. And so it's just, yeah. and it died. Run. No, no point. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I think that's all I got time for. Now it's time to let Jared make his yeah. own seed. So Jared's... Yeah. yeah, Jared's seen some spoilers. I gotta go get ready for another thing, so thanks for having me, yep. everyone. Thanks yeah, for taking the time. Fun. See y'all next time, Twitch chat. Hi, Memory Area asks, are there only three survivors in that seed? Uh, there are three to five survivors uh, in every seed, so it might be the case, but there was also a couple different directions right. that Dave didn't explore. So you actually don't know, because that's how seeding works. That's, yep. Actually, none of that will be spoilers because I will get nowhere near as far as Dave. Well, you should make a new seat anyway. <laughs> yeah. Is that how I do that? Press main menu? That's the first part of how you do that. What's next? New cycle? I'm not going to tell you, Jared. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Chat, you want to help Jared out? This, this is a puzzle game. What are you doing? You can I'm looking at what though. options I have. <laughs> Immediately, the criticism starts. I can see how this is going to be. It's always something with you people. We're used to Dave. He's a professional. <laughs> you know, the, listen, if there's an options button you don't want me clicking on, you better take it out of the game. <laughs> there's, there's a myth that writers are defensive. Would you like to defend that now? Wait, uh, do, do we really need to turn the volume up on the game? Because, like, that's... No, right? I don't know. I think take notification that. just really like. I'm gonna take the that seriously. Can turn volume. Turn up. it up a little bit. All right. So now you're making a new your game. Cycle name. So you can name your playthrough, which is the name of your save. Ah. No, no, no. Too late. <laughs> Too late. And then most importantly, name your seed because anybody that's actually watching this can enter your same seed and play oh, your game. Yeah. All right. I'll turn so it back a down. seed is essentially just how everything is spaced out and like what is laid where. Uh, the seed is the key that gets used to randomly generate the world. So if you hand somebody the same oh. seed, they'll play the same game. And that's because, uh, because it, it's really fun to be able to choose to play the to game. to your friends that I did this and you couldn't? Well, or challenge them. See how good you can I'm do loading. a particular seed. Alright, my cycle name is Cycle01, the new era. That's your name, and uh, now your seed. We really have you've a got, here. You've <laughs> actually got some recommendations for seed from the chat. All right, what do we got? Cat. I hate cats. Oh, oh the internet hates me. Yeah, now. Come on, we, we, nah, we're on the internet nah. live, and you just said Jeez. that. Jeez. You got cat name Abracadabra. Our viewer count just. Oh, Abracadabra is a Pokemon. So let's go ahead and go That's Pokemon. Um, and I don't feel quite like I'm evolved enough. Right, to do Abra. Abracadabra, so we just got to do Abra. So Pokemon space Abra, capital P, capital A, is this seed. Pick a better name. Two I'm sorry, legs. Rizoma. M M O Z. No, it's not backwards. Whenever I see a capital letter at the end, I want to spell it backwards. I think it's Rizoma, right? Rizoma. 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 Sabrin. I should change the name. Rizoma. Oh, I need to change this person's name, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, so 
a Mosier. Hey, Mosier. Hey, Mosier. That's a good name. Yeah. Wow. Name my cat that. <laughs> oh. I love cats. Yeah, why not Zoidberg? <laughs> Well, that's the second. <laughs> we'll get we'll get a Zoidberg in there. That's a good idea. All right, <laughs> scroll to zoom, click to rotate. Oh, click that to rotate. That was my fault. That was not the instructions' fault. I'm gonna go click on the shiny over here. To anyone that gets us, Fueling shuttle, Doctor the camp. <laughs> well, I hope that person died because they aren't very nice. You gotta read it for the class, Jerry. Yeah, you should read. Oh, it I need to read it for the class. Yeah. So there's a refueling shuttle. Hold on, I'm getting there again. Docked in the camp. Anyone who isn't there when I get there gets left behind. And uh, I just don't think that's kind. Well, it was an unsent message, so they probably thought better of it. Oh, you know what? You're right. They were like, you know what? No, I'm being a jerk. Right. Like, why am I even I'll wait this? for everyone. I should just leave and not send this terrible <laughs> message. You realize there's a corpse in front of you in the middle of the room, right? Yeah, but I can't click on it. Sure. Oh, but it's that dude. He died while he was typing the message. And don't I feel bad now? Should I name the corpse? Mr. Corpse. Spiritually. <laughs> Mr. Corpse. Try to send an email. Pipe. Good. Bullets from my pipe. Excellent. Oh, I've got a gun. Where'd I get a gun? Didn't I have to pick up a gun last time I played this? You did pick up a gun. Wait, where'd I pick up a gun? I don't remember. I have no memory of this place. Attention UNC expedition members. We are attempting to regain radio contact with the dive ships outside the null point. Please remain in your base camps in the meantime. Above all else, remain calm. Use of issued diazane injections is authorized if necessary. I gotta find out what diazane is. You should check your inventory. Oh, I've got leaves. Leaves, leaves. That's a... Leaves is the appropriate you're, term. You're a great word. Let's man. let's stop referencing my my job description. <laughs> Wait, where's my uh, walk? Deploy inventory. Inventory. You're a little lower. There it is. Yeah, just but like there's left click. Oh, I just got to click. Oh, there. I, I was expecting a a hover for some reason. All right. Wait. That, oh, oh, those are my bullets. That doesn't leave. Okay. Diazan compound used to treat extreme anxiety and panic attacks often prescribed to combat the effects of sleep, deep space travel on the psyche, despite the risk of addiction. I should just pop that right now. I'm feeling pretty addicted. So uh, high memory area wants to know if the non-lootable stuff in rooms is, is randomized. I'm going to turn this I, on right now. Furniture and stuff. Oh, all, all of the clutter does get re-randomized. We, we do more than just uh, randomize the, the rooms themselves. So uh, inside all of our rooms, C. there are about three to four quadrants, X. and all of those get randomized as well. C. Oh, but those, those are also kept the same uh, inside of a seed. I'm out of here. I can't see that. Okay. Let's go read this. I already know all of this. Yeah, all of the notes in this room are sort of your basic tutorialization. Gotcha. Oh, I can't, I can't hold that. Oh, We're no. Full up now. What do I do? I need to find another person. This person. You'll be my medic. Sleep space travel. Chalbert. Oh, that's ridiculous. I know. that. Yeah, that yeah, name needs to name. And then it's a change immediately. This is Zoidberg. Ah, uh, that's true. Zoidberg is a good one. No, you know what's better? Space Zoidberg. Oh, all right. The original one isn't quite spacey enough. Get up, Space Zoidberg. It's time. It's like he was looking up at you, like, really? Are you, are you sure? That's what I am now? Click. Come over here and get this first aid kit. You can also have this pipe. There, now we're oh, in front. I'm, I'm sorry, Rezo. I, I should think before I speak. <laughs> Job Bear's a nice name. <laughs> Thank you, Mike T. I don't believe anybody would name that child, though. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this is the last time we ever going to put you up on the internet. <laughs> I know. First the cats, then I'm insulting names. I'm I'm just I'm the I'm the anti-hero. People cheer for me to lose. Another pipe? Why not? Yeah, load up on pipes. Oh wait, where the? Oh, I can't get it. All right, I need you. Wait, what's over here? Oh yeah, look at all these pipes. You should have a child, Jalbert. Jalbert, Jalbert. 
We'll, we'll see. <laughs> Sounds like a fancy restaurant. <laughs> is that your <laughs> is that your category for naming children? <laughs> yeah, I think, I think that's what you want. What's the Michelin star rating of the restaurant? <laughs> the How many Chabers are in the name? <laughs> All right. We're traveling on this there. space soccer ball there. as we explore. <laughs> Torn apart by endless rugby matches. Oh, purple triangle. Oh, all right. Now I'm going to turn on some walkers here. We're just going to go this way. We're going to be real quiet. We don't want to wake him up. If I, if I take the chance to go back and get the Gauss thing, will I be able to carry it from level to level? In the full game, absolutely. Uh, in fact, the way that the full game works is that you will always be going back to your ship. Yeah, right there at the top. Yeah, I know. I'm going to try to do this and run. He's trying to sneak around it. All right, fair enough. All right, we've lost visual. Yeah, Griblet, uh, once you gather something, if you can take you it back care. to your ship, you'll be able to put it in storage and then take it from place to place. Well, what is this green thing that looks like I'm in the iris of an eye? The, the, your, your, your sanity is being affected by looking for your guys looking at the... What, for real? Yep. Yep. Is the green stuff my sanity? It is. <gasps> Yeah, I hovered over it. There we go. Um, okay, so I, I'm full on sanity. You're completely sane. I like that. I like that uh, kind of uh, a Lovecraftian twist to all this, that you have the staring into the endless abyss of horrific unknowns. Dizan. Um, can I stack that? Let's see. <gasps> oh, I'm walking, I'm walking. Everybody get out of there. Notice how I click faster <laughs> when it goes to walk faster. Sneak, 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 sneak. Sneak as fast as you can. Now, you're actually a very good sneaker. This is uh, impressive. Is it? Yeah. I feel like I haven't... Oh. ZZ Talk says, I wish I had a HUD for my life that displayed my sanity. There actually is one. Uh, right now, it only shows up if you're below 25% uh, sanity. Oh, sorry. I remember here. I didn't read tentacles. <laughs> I was very confused. <laughs> Great. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. What, is he coming for me? He knows where I am. Yeah. They can uh, hear you. SGZZ Talk asks... Oh, dear heavens. Uh, ...for an overhead uh, display of their sanity health bar. Uh, that does exist. Because it gets a little busy if we show it all the time, the way that we show health, we have it set so that it only appears when your sanity gets really low. But that's the kind of thing that we'd be throwing into an options menu. So that you could choose to show it all the time if you wanted to. These people were being operated on by the Shamblers. They're learning our doctor ways. Yeah, there, there's something scary there. Yeah, look at that. The Shamblers were like trying to figure out how we tick. All right, is the game, the, nobody is moving. There's no idle animations on the screen. So I'm assuming this is paused. Yeah, while you I'm can take your time to name. Yes, okay, good. Because... Sleep... Space nine. <laughs> yes, this is this is the way of things. I've been watching all the Bob Ross on Twitch, so I really want to. Yeah, just so, just so. Have you really? I have. Yeah, I, I watched it last <laughs> night as I was falling asleep. I'm assuming that that's why we. That's, that's you know, it's hurting our viewership. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't doubt it. Let's get grouped up here. Let's everybody stay in a line. Can I do that? No. Yeah. Okay. No, no, no. A happy little line. A happy. They just want to be in a happy little line. You know what? Use your imagination. Put them in whatever formation you want to be in. I, I agree, Co Coach Optimus. <gasps> All right. Shan was doing some oh. kind of weird dance. Let's watch his pathing. We'll watch his pathing, see where he goes, and time it correctly. So, did, What's here? Not, is it pathing or is it shambling? Um, uh, it is actually different per Guys, stop looking at him. Uh, we have Turn some around. enemies that path and some enemies that just pick Wait. random directions Turn to around. walk in. There, now they're not looking at him anymore. Okay, okay yeah, now I look thought, at him I thought again. they didn't all keep pathing. Well, it looks like this one is. Okay, turn around again. Stop looking. Stop. Stop looking. Don't look at him. Very good. Okay, now let's go. Walk quietly. Shh. Oh, he's not going the way I expected him to. But oh. it's okay. No, this is this is excellent sneaking. We're gonna be fine. 
Yeah, you're doing you're doing a much now, better if job this, than Dave. If this is anything like my Metal Gear Solid runs, pretty soon I'm just going to unload and kill everybody in the level as soon as I get detected once. I know, right? <laughs> no, that's what you do, right? You, yeah, you, you panic and then you shoot everyone. Yeah. It's of like, course. you know what? If that one dude hadn't seen me, everybody could have lived. That's no, right. You've no, ruined it for a, everyone. Uh, there's a lore note in the middle of that. Right? I know, and I really want it. So I'm going to send in Space Soidberg. No. Who's closest? Oh, Sleep Space Nine. With no weapons or anything. Well, that's... Hey, yeah, you're... No. I mean, I don't want to lose anything. All right, this is not paused. So I'm going to go that's back. True. Oh, but... Oh, no! But you've uh, got to be near it to read I, it, Jared. Well, this game certainly has realism down pat. I'll give it that. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's give it another go. He's behind a wall, I think, so we're going to be okay. All right, yeah, he's good. Attention, research staff. All radio communication is currently being scrambled by an unknown source in Shell 2. Forward expedition teams are breaching the shell now. Find the cause of the disturbances. In the meantime, remain calm and report into your station's base camp. Shuttles from the Galahad will be within the next 48 hours. Oh, crap. Guys, I read it. That was, that was very impressive. All right, now let's get out of here. All right, where's the exit yeah, to this room? Right, so has a good point. <laughs> it is just a piece of paper. <laughs> yeah. Be really quiet. I'm going to read this. They're all, they're all glued to the floor. Turn yeah, high, high memory place. area is right. Okay, okay, no, stop talking. Oh my gosh! It's a trap! Yeah, thanks. Oh no! <laughs> Everybody! Oh, you're in trouble there. Oh. Do it! Do the thing! Yeah, do, do, do Julie, thing. do the thing! <laughs> Hit him with your pipe if you can. And you did it while walking. <laughs> Who are yeah, you? We, we appreciate that, Jobo. It's, it's, it's a little scary right now with the Kickstarter, but uh, keep we'll, we'll keep telling people, and you can keep telling people too, and, and hopefully we can still pull it out. <laughs> I think Sleep Space yep. 9 deployed with no weapons. Is that, is that a thing that would happen? That's a thing that you can tell them to do. He was like, I'm ready, guys, you kill that one. <laughs> you are useless, Sleep Space Nine. She, she's menacingly pointing her finger at the... Oh, uh, you know what? Space Zoidberg can't take the space heat. He really needs a... He needs a little... fix. I'll fix you up real nice there, Space Zoidberg. Make you feel good. There we go. Here's another dead body. Ah, oh, Space Zoidberg loves pipes. That's his thing. In fact, you take those so I can have your pipe. Wow, you've, you've gone quad pipe. Congratulations. <laughs> I, I mean, don't think that's happened. There's an achievement days. for that, right? Like, Ah, <laughs> uh, see? I used one. Oh, I'm going to get four people. Who's, awesome. who's my mule here? You are. There you go. You go get that. Meanwhile, you go get this person. I love that uh, iconography there. That's gorgeous. Colonel yeah, we, Sanders. We got a lot of feedback that it was way too hard to spot. Well, let's survivors. put Colonel Sanders in there. All right. Well, let's let's switch it up a bit. He was um, promoted to Admiral Sanders. It's not just about chicken anymore. It's a whole different branch oh, of the military. Yeah. Too. Well, <laughs> <laughs> what do I know about military, Mike? <laughs> I'm in space. But there's another one, guys. Guys, get over there. Wait, did you find another survivor? No, I found a, another Chandler. Wait, am I in the same room? Yeah, I don't think you left the room. That's the shambler you stuck All right, one. Admiral Sanders, your first job. No, Sleep Space Nine. Go get that first aid kit. We'll wait here for you. Oh, but you have all my first aid kits. It's going to take a while for the power walk over there. Well, this is the price you pay when you... Oh, crap. <laughs> <laughs> where is everyone? Helvetication is right. You've left the Admiral. Wait, where is Admiral? Down. I'm just going to do a full sweep of the area. There, you there go. we go. <laughs> All right. If you double click on their I can portrait. Do th yeah, I can do this, right? <laughs> All right. We get one more. It could be Private Ryan. Yeah, so just so you can save him. <laughs> All right. So everybody go get. Nope, nope. There, there are multiple shamblers now. They weren't there before. I'm missing somebody. You need to walk like the rest of us. Uh, th there's no avoiding this. Well, <clears throat> yes, there is. <laughs> Maybe you need to have a conversation with Space Zoidberg about his pipe boarding. I mean... I think there is a select all button, right? Uh, you can actually make a control group that does it right now. We might, we might make something by default, but if you go uh, control one, every, then, then you can use shift one to select everybody. Everybody kill. 
kill until there's nothing left. Hit him with your pipe again. Very nice. Everybody get back over here. The other well, one's you, you made a bunch of noise there. Yeah, that's okay, though. We're going to do this. You're deploying a guy with a pipe. Yeah, well, he's our last line of defense. This person does this. And then these two. They're our back line. This is my healer. I don't, I don't like this plan. He's, yes. he's holding fire. <laughs> it's gonna be, wait, why are you holding fire? <laughs> do the thing. Steve Space Nine was like, what are you guys doing? <laughs> <laughs> can, can I have maybe one of those pipes? Maybe? <laughs> no, there is a natural order to things, Sleep Space Nine, and you're not a part of it. I'm beginning to think he's not a real admiral. <gasps> Wait, why can't... Oh, all for this first aid kit. All for that first aid kit that's still bugged. Son of a monkey's uncle. We're going to play the prototype card on that one? Fair enough. Just know, just know that Sleep Space Nine, <laughs> that's her one job, and she failed because of you. Um, I don't know where the exit... Oh, there must be another room out here. All right, that room was like in my stealth run. It never happened. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. So that's, that's right. bonus. Yeah. That was just, go in there. No, that's, because, because there was a prototype bug, you, you get a mulligan on the stuff. Right? Yeah. I think, I think it's fair. I like that. All right. Somebody, we finally had an intervention, and Spice Zoidberg has uh, agreed that one pipe for each of these people is acceptable. Space Zoidberg has been accepted as part of the group now, though. He will no longer go on suicide missions. Well, there you go. I don't think I've... Is this a, a tutorial piece? Yeah, you're back yeah. in the tutorial. Oh, okay, room. all right. Let's... Actually, you're in the room beyond it. I don't know if you have read that one. Uh-oh. Let's all go read it together as a family, now that Space Zoidberg's no longer hoarding the pipes. Just cluster up in AoE range. Oh, you did read this one. Yes, yes, yes. All right. Let's go down to this room. Well, you can see from the mini-map in the top that you've been that way. Oh, oh I, you know, I haven't glanced at the mini-map once this entire game. I, I have to say, I love that there's a mini-map now. I, I, That's I, going to be super useful. Oh, it. this is the room that disturbed me. The one that really got me. Yeah, there we go. You really haven't been the same since. I, I, I agree. All right. Everybody be quiet. We don't know what's beyond these doors. Space Orberg, you need a little healing? No, I'm good. All right, let's go. <laughs> Space Orberg. He'll never, he'll never tell you if he's hurt. It's just the way he is. All right. Good thing is a health meter floating. That's it. All right, well, there's something big in here, so we're going to all hug the wall. Hug remember, the wall. nobody's holding fire right now. Oh, crap. Everybody, hold your pipe fire. If you uh, use the Z key, you can toggle all of your selected guys between hold fire and open fire. Ah, I'm going to be honest with you. My wrist hurts really bad. I can't reach the Got Z it. key. It's just not something in my power right now. Oh my gosh, guys. This Admiral Sanders. Wow, what do you want? Why don't you go ahead and scout ahead? I don't know who the leader of the party is. I guess it's Amazir. All right, it's walking away. What's in here? Let's see. All right. I like our chances. This space soccer ball has been ripped apart. Look at this. They have no... They have, they have no concept of playing soccer fairly. They want only to destroy. Green light. Green light looks awesome. Green means go, right? So that means we're going the right way. <gasps> Dead. Is that a dead person or a dead Chambler? It's a dead person. Let's go read what they had to say. Yeah, they, they died holding a piece of paper, though. They died holding a piece of paper. Zorberg, you're no longer the person who needs to do this. You are, Sanders. Everybody else, coast is clear. Let's scoot on up. I, I, I don't know. You got something behind you. He was in the other room, though. We're fine. Okay. All right. Wait. That's a light. Um... There's, there's a light behind us. Of that much, I'm sure. Delay, if you're reading this, please be careful. You're on the way to the shuttle dock. Something walked off on the wall. Windshell 2 opened and cut my in half. Dear God, that's all I need to read. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Zoidberg is like, guys, I can only give up my ways so long. I need another pipe. We got to the part about cutting in half and we left the room. That thing is just straight up coming the same way we are. Um, 
but it's going that way, so why don't we start? No, all right, I've hesitated too long. This is no longer a good decision, but I have to make it anyway. All right, it turned around. All right, since it turned around, we're gonna wait for it to get a little further away before we open the door. Let's watch that light. Yes. No, well, I, see the, I see the light, but I don't see it. Why is that? I'm just not seeing it. Because it is in the fog of war. Okay. So you, you can only see what your uh, survivors have line of sight to. Got it. But, but, but we, the, the player, can see the light no matter what. <gasps> but you, the player, can see the light no matter what. Because it feels a little bit unfair if you can't see that light until it's right on top of you. Yeah, sure. All right, it didn't hear the door. Of that, I am sure. <gasps> oh, but they did. Come over, come over, come over, come over, come over, come over, come over. Everything's gonna be fine. Just shut your mouths. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's gonna be okay. The Admiral's command is tough, but fair. <laughs> yeah. And he was the last one found. He really has no jurisdiction here, but... I... Nice, he stepped up. All right, Amazir. Oh, who's the most sane right now? Admiral, you look. Look at them. Behold, See, he's got it together. Behold what they're doing. Yes. Oh my gosh, there were three of them. They're, they're just, oh, uh, oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. I, think I don't think you're going to be sneaking. Everybody? Wait, stay calm, stay calm. I, I, I can't, I can't. Holy crap. All right, all right. All right, back to walk, back to walk. See. See. Oh no. C isn't working. It is working. See? Oh, okay. You just actually have to press the key. <laughs> no, no, that doesn't make any sense, Patrick. <laughs> Why would I press the key to do say, what it does? You just say the letter C out loud. All right. It's obvious these things have no discernible patterns. That means there's no humanity left within them. We no longer have to feel bad about Yeah, I, I know, I know, Joe. This is really an intense moment. Like, I, it seems like they're going to see him at any moment, and they're not. Oh my gosh, this went so close. We blend in, though. All right, the other ones went back in, and that's not a good thing for me either. We're gonna slowly start creeping up. Don't turn it. Oh, oh no, no, no! All right, it's over now. It's over for all of us. Only one of us makes it out of here alive. No, no, no! no Pipe no. crew. Just, just relax, relax. All right, all right, all right. Get back in your corner. Get back there. in the corner, everybody. In the corner. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's all turn around. All right. No, one at no. a time. Are they going to see the dead Shambler and wonder what happened? Or is that <laughs> not the no, the, the Shamblers aren't that smart. Jerry! Jerry, what happened to you? Are, I should have Are there enemies out. that are that smart? We, we're planning to have enemies that are that smart. Oh, crap. No, All right, here we go. No, they're on you. Beat him with a pipe. Beat him with a pipe. Beat him with a pipe. It's Ace uh, Oh, and uh, his ears about to uh, freak uh, out? No, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. No, it's not. Don't. What? Why it's isn't okay. it cool? No, it's okay. It's what, are you, what are you talking about? No, you're it's good. fine. You're good. Sleep Space Nine, you're fine, right? Everybody's cool. All right, we're going to use our last one on Space Zoidberg. He's bleeding. None of this is good right now. None of this is good. All right, I feel comfortable doing this because we're all going to be looking together. So from now on, nobody looks alone. Oh my gosh, no, there was one right there! It's, oh, please, that's, oh that's the problem with clumping up. <laughs> no! <laughs> Who's hurt? Admiral Sanders! Oh, you got, wait, I think the shovel's up here! Bleeding. Go! People are bleeding. All of you, we have no time! Go! Sanders, you were the best of us. Dear God, why are we running? <laughs> <laughs> Why are we slowly walking to the shuttle when we're all dying? There you go. <laughs> no, that was awesome. <laughs> Am I going to win? I did it. Admiral Sanders survives. You and you made it with four people. There were first people aid out. on there. First aid on the ship. That was a no death run. A no death run. So stealth worked out for you. And yeah. I got the four pipe part. <laughs> sure. Pipe yes, order. Yes, and you, you get the four pipe unlocked. Yes. That was awesome. I gotta say, every time I play this game, it is more and more fun. Like, you guys are trending in such an upward direction that it's insane. Well, thanks for taking... I might need some of that green stuff to really save you my sanity for how good this game is going to go on. Well, it's a demo day, so I think that's stuff? downstairs. <laughs> awesome. Thanks for letting me play. I find your shirt offensive. 
What? And uh, I'll Wait, see you guys next time. your shirt offensive. What? As well as your beard, sir. <laughs> and on that note, and thanks so much for everybody for uh, checking in. Uh, again, this exact build is live right now if you want to download it and play it. We'll probably be doing a couple of small updates to it just to fix little bugs like the missing note that we found earlier. Um, but otherwise, uh, that's the build that we're going to be sending out to a lot of live streamers and Let's Players next week. I love Coach Optimus' comment. The more pipes you have, the more you can put them around you as camouflage. It's, it just yeah, makes sense. <laughs> And please, if there is anybody out there that uh, you think would enjoy a game like this, let them know about it. Yeah, We're just sure. trying to get the word out. Yes, yeah, send it to your favorite Twitch or, or Let's Player. Uh, anything you can do to get people's attention on the Kickstarter will help us immensely, and we really appreciate it. And yeah, that's it. Uh, we'll see you guys next week. Thanks for coming. And have fun with the build. Yeah, goodbye. <laughs>